What's up, people? This is Skip Goes Hard. Y'all know what it is, man. The most underrated, never duplicated sneaker YouTuber in the game, September 4th, 2018. Look what we have here. I was minding my own business, sitting down at the house, going through my little uh, ho-ass Instagram feed, and I came across Nice Kicks. Nice Kicks, which I follow them. Uh, posted this shoe right here, man. This is a what an Air Jordan 20 mellow fly knit. Now, off top, when I saw this shoe, you know what? No, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I was like, wow, because they 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 did something different in a way to the Air Jordan 20. I have a pair of dead stock Air Jordan 20s that I'm gonna show you all at the end of this video. But let's talk about this Air Jordan 20 right here, mellow inspired. Uh, unlike the OG 20s, these have the fly knit on them. I can honestly say that this is probably the first time besides maybe those black fly knit 3s that fly knit did justice on an Air Jordan. Now, don't get me wrong. The Air Jordan 1s, they're cute, you know, with the fly knit. But fly knit on this shoe and fly knit on those Air Jordan 3s, sweet, sweet. Now, you have orange on the back of the shoe. Uh, kind of like a maybe like a green uh, maybe like an army type green on the strap which looks like it's leather around top of the ankle and then on that little front plate now on air jordan 20s that's velcro that you that you uh like the strap you know what i mean now i don't i'm not sure if it's velcro on this one it could be like a little button which i believe that's on like on the air jordan 16s i i think i'm not really sure don't beat me up but we see lace locks on these Air Jordan 20s. The OG Air Jordan 20s do not have lace locks on them. Now, on this side, like I said, around that strap, get the strap looking as there's a leather around the ankle and then around that front part where the shoelaces are. And then you see that lace lock. We have like maybe like an orange around the midsole, orange on the back, but these Air Jordan 20s, they uh they're kind of like a like a sock, like a like a booty, you know what I mean? The OG Air Jordan 20s are like I'm not like that. Now on the back of this shoe, um, you have the the two jumpmans on the back, and then that nice leather strap that that you can see from the back, and then the orange. And then on the bottom of this Air Jordan 20 Mellow Inspired Fly Knit, orange all on the bottom. You got those sweet little cute little pods that's placed uh differently along the bottom of the shoe now they have two colorways of this shoe this one that we're looking at right now this orange and green and then the next colorway which this looks like a, a nice colorway black and like a gum bottle man same thing from the shoe before you got the leather around the strap covering the shoelaces and then you got the leather strap around the uh the ankle part of the shoe the whole upper is black you got 7 20 and 23 and kind of like that gum uh that, that that gum colorway and then on this aerial view looking below from up top, you got the two Jumpmans in gold, and I believe it says Mellow inside a sock line of two Jumpmans. Uh, on the other side of the shoe, man, like I said, man, you got that black upper, black kind of like flying it, but it's not, maybe like an anthracite, maybe it's not like a like a black ass black black, but it's, you know, maybe like an anthracite. And then from the back of the shoe, you got the two Jumpmans and that gum bottom you know, coming back from the, uh, you know, from the back of the shoe, man. These look good, man. Fly knit on the Air Jordan 20. Hey, I can dig it. Y'all let me know if y'all like this because I'm, I'm, I'm liking it, man. This should be a hyped up shoe. This is kind of shoe that should be limited in my opinion, accurate opinion. You know what I mean? Gum bottom on the bottom of the, uh, of the shoe, man. I mean, the, these are looking real nice. I, I like it. Now we're going to get to my pair. All right, y'all, this is my pair of my OG Air Jordan 20 dead stock. Now, it came in this box, square type box with that silver, maybe like a chrome Jumpman and this Wi-Fi looking ass uh, <laughs> design right here. On the left side of the box, it says Jordan. On the back of it, you have more of the design, which we'll get into that when I open the shoe. 
Uh, this design was kind of like based off Michael Jordan's life. There's different kind of shoes in here. There's a car in there. There's a whole bunch of like different symbols. Then you got Jordan on the other side of the shoe box. And then here is the size. 10 and a half Air Jordan 20. White, varsity red, and black. Color code. And you know I never do a color code. This must be a special ass video. <laughs> 3104551161 made in China and these came out in 2005 man for 175 dollars size 10 and a half now the reason why I kept this shoe dead stock was because I believe like when these first came out these were supposed to be like a, a special ed edition Air Jordan 20 Jumpman Bostic if you're watching man let me know if that was this them talking out their asses or whatever or was this supposed to be like a special edition uh air jordan 20. opening the box flip this up and on the inside of the box it pretty much shows like the technology of the shoe you know what i mean like it says uh like showing the ankle strap and then it's supposed to be like the uh like the inside of the sole stuff like that and you know, this is the ankle strap and uh independent popular suspicion su <laughs> suspension suspension oh i meant to say podular not popular i'm tripping oh gosh hooked on phonics uh works for me an independent podular suspension right there bam there we go now uh i kept this sh these shoes in ziploc bags shout out to the soulmates uh man uh he 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 uh he talked about a video on how he keeps his air jordan ones uh, in a Ziploc bag, and that keeps from them uh, doing that glitter effect. That's what's up. I also keep my J's in Ziploc bags too, as you can see, like right here. But I, I haven't really put my ones in a Ziploc bag. Maybe if I did, it might cut out from the glittering. Like I said, man, shout out to the soulmates. All right, so let me go ahead and take these out. Let's do it. Oh, before I take the shoes out the Ziploc bag down there, these shoes came with a kind of like a little net little netting bag whatever with that 8505 uh i guess it was like the 20th anniversary 20 right there 8505 on uh on the on the little netting bag whatever and then it came with this kind of like i guess circular maybe like jordan card with all the jordans one through 20 flip it over and then it has some type of little uh i don't know a little symbol thing and it was part of the you know the 20th anniversary 1985 to 2005 jumpman 23.com blah 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 all right so we're gonna go ahead and yeah, man. <laughs> we're gonna open these shoes up all right we have an og pair of air jordan 20s now as you can see uh the ankle strap right here is kind of like a maybe like a uh maybe like a new book not really a suede, but like a, a new book kind of material. And then you see Jordan uh, around the uh, like the front of the ankle strap. And it has the uh, the Velcro, as you all can see right there. And on that strap that covers the shoe, uh, the shoe strings, the shoelaces. This is what I was telling you all about, man. Uh, it has like, I think there's a pair of like an Air Jordan, some, uh, some 11s right there, a Nike swoosh. I believe this is supposed to be uh, Michael Jordan's dad's toolbox. And then you have a pair of Air Jordan 5s. And you got 13 for some reason. Death defying. All kinds of symbols. It says AJ3 uh, right there. And there's a whistle right there. Where is that car at? There goes a car. I think this is like his old car that uh, Michael Jordan's dad used to drive. And I guess that's a Black Cat MVP5. There's a whole bunch of like little neat designs on the uh air jordan 20 and then you got that jump man right there in the middle of it now on the sides of it y'all see you had the little uh maybe like a little rainbow effect a little bit like this was the reason why i think i believe these were supposed to be the uh special edition air jordan 20s now on the mellow ones up top where uh y'all see this little jump man right here there is where the lace lock is on the mellow Air Jordan 20s, but like on these, like I said, it's no uh, no lace lock. Now, let me put it right here. Now you can lift this up, and it's kind of like a uh, you know, hold on. Bam, Velcro right there, no lace lock, 
and then take this strap uh pull that back my bad i'm like working with one hand right now oh my glove ah looking at uh you got the shoe shoelaces right there and there goes the inside of the strap there's nothing in here like i was it'll be cool like they had like like a little jump man symbol or something like that but it's velcro and i believe the mellow uh those mellow 20 should be velcro too i'm not sure you know what i mean because it could be uh you know like buttons and it could snap like a button we don't know yet but closing that back up um yeah and then right here this is kind of like a suede and we got this material right here. Y'all see like a little rainbow right here, man. I believe these aren't a special edition, man. I know. Jumpman Boston, like I said, man, if you're watching this video, hit me up. Let me know, man. Leave a comment. And then on the sides of this, this, uh, you know, this regular, okay, I don't know what I can really just call this material, man. This shoe material, Air Jordan-ish, whatever. And then on the back, like I said, you have that <laughs> funny like little Wi-Fi thing. You got a Jumpman in the back, just like on the uh, Mellow 20s. And then you got some numbers 45. So this should be, you know, 45, the number that he wore when he played baseball. And then when he came back to the uh, NBA and then the six championships, whatever. And then a 20. Hmm. I'm not sure. 23, like his number, then 45. Uh, and then a six should be, you know, the championships, whatever. And then on the bottom of this shoe, you know, you got uh, like little pods and more symbols. All right there. I'm not sure if those if the Mellow Twenties had like these symbols right there. I'm not I'm not really sure because I, I know it had like little pods and little circles and stuff like that. But as far as the detailed symbols, I'm not really sure. This is the right shoe, and then we have the the left shoe right here. Same thing, nothing uh, really different, you know what I mean? Same symbols, jump man, little Wi-Fi symbol thing, and then all the little symbols on top of the strap or whatever. And then on the inside of the shoe, it has, uh, let me see. Um, I guess, like I think that's probably like an eye, maybe one of Jordan's eyes and stuff like that. I'm not really sure. Let me look at the inside of this right. Uh-oh, it has like the little... Dang, um, you know what? I don't feel like taking that out. Shit. Anyway, look. Hey man, I'm Skip Ghost Hard, the most underrated, never duplicated sneaker YouTuber in the game. Like the video, leave a comment, share the video, and subscribe to the channel. I hope you all enjoyed my little semi-detailed look of these OG Air Jordan 20s right here. Uh kind of comparing it to the mellow 20s that you just uh you all just saw earlier. Uh, at the beginning of this video, man, let me know if you like those mellow 20s. Let me know if you like these OG 20s right here. Let me know, man. Talk to me. Like I said, I read all the comments. Oh, snap. Ah! Ah! Bam. Clean, man. Dead stock. And I have my, uh, my other Air Jordan uh, 20s right there. You know what I mean? I had a pair of all black stealth uh air jordan 20s but they somebody got me at the airport anyway i don't even want to talk about that bullshit anyway so yeah man like i said man i'm skip ghost hard the most underrated never duplicated sneaker youtube in the game like the video leave a comment share the video and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching my little whole ass videos thank you so much that is it watch the ads and y'all know what it is man watch that ass i'm out peace listen to what ken cade has to say at the end of this video what's up Kincaid reporting for duty. You reached the end of the video. So what you need to do is click that little whole ass subscribe button right there to subscribe to Skip Goes Hard channel. And then you need to watch this little whole ass video right here and check out this little punk ass video right there. Do it. You got nothing else better to do. I'm out. Peace.